So I don't think that I've changed the tank since the last update. Yeah, so like the food dishes here, coconut hut, water dish, like little castle, this, all that. Um, but I do have a story of what happened to one of my hermit crabs because in the last update I still had six hermit crabs but now I only have five. So um, yeah, I'll be telling you guys what happened with that. And yeah, so let's just go ahead and do that. So anyways, what happened was Otis, which is one of my smaller hermit crabs, uh, was just walking around like, I mean, he had chain shells and stuff, and so I was like, oh, that's good, because Otis has always kind of been, like, always hiding from the other hermit crabs and stuff, like, he would go into the castle, and then he would just, like, stay in the castle, and he would, I never would see him come out for, like, food or water, so I started having to, like, put the castle really close to the water dish so that I would know he was going in there and making sure that he was getting the water, and I would put the food in there with him in the castle, and I always thought that maybe the other hermit crabs would bully him or something like that, like, he just didn't get along with them because it always seemed like he was trying to hide from them, um, but yeah, so basically that's what I would always have to do, but, um, what ended up happening is one day I just see him walking around the tank without a shell on and this was really crazy because I've I've seen my hermit crabs change shells and stuff but they've never been to the point of like stress where they're just like walking without a shell on because that is a sign that your hermit crab is severely stressed out and Otis has always had problems and I don't like yeah so that was that and um so he was and then he just got into the water dish he was just like drinking water as if like nothing wrong like nothing bad was happening like he was just acting like you know just going to get some water and so um what I did was I just I freaked out I was I just took the shell I put it in there next to him in the water and I was like please change back um and so he actually did go back into the shell and I was like okay I hope he's fine um so then I check on him later he's still in the shell like everything's fine but then a couple days later I see him walking around without a shell on again and then um <clears throat> he did change back into that a different shell the other shell again but then one day another like a couple days later after that i go and check on him again and this time he has no sorry my beta fish is doing something really weird and i don't know what he's doing okay anyways um so otis was once again had i didn't see him anywhere because both of the shells were there and i didn't know where he was so I kind of thought he may have just like gone under the sand and molt because you know he obviously was having some problems <laughs> um so uh I just was like but then a couple days like I still he hadn't come back out like I didn't really know what he was doing um so uh it was time for me to change the food because it was it was actually like the next day it was like the next day so I went to change the food I pick up the food dish and there is Otis's dead body laying there and yeah so he died and uh, I just have the craziest hermit crab stories all the time like my hermit crabs are like they go through this huge time where they're not doing anything which is the time we're in right now where they're just being nothing new really besides that um and then all of a sudden like they just start acting crazy like one of them escapes or like they lose their shell Ugh, so crazy like I have so many I don't know if you guys have seen some of my other hermit crab update videos and story times but like I have seen it all with hermit crabs like honestly it's insane but yeah so um that's what happened this time so now I'm down to five hermit crabs and I don't think everyone always asks me like are you gonna get more like are you planning on getting any other pets but after my hermit crabs die I don't think I'm gonna get them again at least not for a while because it is like a lot and um <clears throat> with school and stuff and yeah and I always I kind of want to try something new maybe get like a crested gecko but um I kind of don't I'm not really sure because I don't know if I want to have any pets after these ones, at least not for like a while, just because it's a lot, you know, and I kind of just would like take a little bit of a break, because I mean, they take up a lot of space, like on my, in my room and stuff, so yeah, but I guess we'll see, because then I don't know what I would make videos about or anything, so yeah, but, so that's that, this, that's pretty much everything new with this update so yeah so thank you all so much for watching this video and i will see you all in my next video bye everyone